Farm owners say heavy rains forced them to open the gates on the property, fearing flooding water would crush their house. The crocodiles escaped their pens and ended up in the Limpopo River. Some have been spotted on neighboring properties and others reportedly seen on a school rugby field in Musina. The farm owners are frantically trying to recapture the missing crocs, warning that they are dangerous. During the day, we don't really catch as many as we want to because they tend to hide away. Um, they're trying to get temperature regulation, so they go in the shade. But at night time, they tend to go and look for water. So here where the rivers come through and taken down the fence, um, they go and trying to get back to the river. They can smell it. So at night time, we have more success. And uh, yeah, you can see the red eyes. It's much easier to see them. For the past three evenings, the personnel of the Rokwena of Crocodile Farm have been out here in the dark searching for lost crocodiles. They find between 500 and 700 crocodiles per day. These crocodiles range in size between 30 centimeters and 4 meters. They're quite big, quite dangerous, but the personnel of the Roquena crocodile farm seems to have it under control. Now catching a crocodile is not a simple task. What they do, they basically, it takes four or five men to actually catch the crocodile and they use a, a string to tie his front and back legs together so the crocodile can't move. And then they come in the morning and they take the crocodiles and they transport it into a dam. Of course, when you have uh, bizarre situations happening or natural um, disturbance like floods and things, then you'll have unnatural behavior or excessive behavior, um, as with crocodiles landing up uh, in large concentrations in rivers and dams and things, and people have to be extra careful. So one doesn't want to uh, install a panic with uh, people that live near water and that. People have been living in and around with crocodiles for hundreds of years and uh, thousands of years without any real problems. But one's got to be careful. Uh, crocodiles uh, are known to be man-eaters. Not just man, woman as well, eh? So yeah, no, people eaters, and uh, um, just be, be careful about them.